Welcome! In front of me I have Amazfit GTS 4 Mini and I'm gonna show you how to pair this watch with the Android phone. First you will need to turn on your watch and you can turn it on by pressing and holding the side button. Keep holding it until you see the uh, Zeb or Amazfit logo on the screen. Once you see the logo you can uh, release the button and wait until the watch turns on. After the watch turns on, you should see the list of languages on the screen. You can scroll through this list by using the touch screen. Basically, you can swipe up and down on it. Now, find the language you like to use on your watch and select it by tapping on the language, like that. And once you select the language, you should see the QR code on the screen. This means we need to download and install the Zep application on our phone. So make sure you have internet connection and Bluetooth enabled. Once you do, tap on the Play Store icon to open the Play Store. In Play Store, tap on search and type in Zep. Then tap search. As you can see, I have it already installed, so let's uninstall it quickly. Like that. And now let's install it by tapping on the install button. And after the application is done installing, you can tap on the open button to open it. After the application opens, you will need to log in into a Zep account, or you can also use the third party accounts right here. If you don't have an account, you can always sign up by tapping on sign up button. I already have an account, so I'm gonna tap right here, enter the email address, then tap right here and enter the password, so give me a couple of seconds. And then we can tap on the sign in button to log in. Once you log in, you should see the home page of the app. Now tap on the profile icon to open the profile page. And here we have this big add device button in the my device category. So let's tap on the add device button, select watch category, tap on got it and allow the permission. Then tap on got it and allow the permission again. This will open the camera app. Basically, what, you, what we need to do is to scan the QR code from our watch with the phone. So pick up the phone, point the phone's camera on the watch, and after a second or two, it should grab the QR code, like this. And once it scans QR code, it will ta start connecting the devices together. Then confirm the pairing on the watch by tapping on the check mark. And here in the app, we can also synchronize the settings from the previous device and data from a previous device if you want to. If you don't want to, you can simply tap on set as new device. If you want to copy one of the types, you can select only one type by tapping on the box right here, or you can do both if you want to. But I'm just gonna tap on set as new device. Then tap on done. And here we have a little tutorial how to use our watch. We can go through it by swiping left on screen and then we can tap on done button. And at this point you should see the device page for your GTS 4 Mini. Also, if you wake up the screen on your watch, you should see the welcome message and also it's asking you or should ask you if you want to go through the instructions. I'm just gonna tap on X to skip it, but you can tap on check mark to go through the tutorial. So let's skip the tutorial. And as you can see, we can use our watch now. Okay. And that's how you pair this watch with the Android phone. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel and leaving the like on the video.